Hey everybody, I just gave this thing a quick rinse and dried it. Figured I'd take this opportunity to show you the whole thing in the light after it's pretty clean. I think it still looks good. Love the black wheels. I'm so glad I did that. Now that I look at this thing, I think those round lights in the front have to go. I'm looking at about a 12 inch LED bar, which is gonna be in keeping with all of the other lighting upgrades I've done. I mean, those are good lights, they're hella, but they just don't seem to really fit the Jeep anymore. They're, they're like uh, very, very white and they kind of stand out on the front end. So I think something a little more sleek with the black housing, I think that'll work. Still digging my third brake light. I'm about ready to hook that up. I'm gonna pull this in the garage and finish that. All I have to do is tap into the wire and I am done. Also got my right and left door seals in the mail today. So I'm gonna put those on and uh, hopefully that won't take too long. Yep, I love it. Stay tuned. I have achieved success with the LED third brake light. It's all hooked up, it's working great. Love the way it looks. What do you think? Hope you like it as much as I do. I think it definitely matches the other two. Let me know what you think. Crusty door seal, completely brittle, had been siliconed on there it looks like. So now I got to pop out all these stupid uh, plastic retainers, they're in the new ones. I got to scrape all this stuff off and clean it and install the new one. This is going to be fun, I have a feeling it's not going to fit very well. Kind of like those window sweep moldings. I don't know, we'll see. Wish me luck. Well, I got the door edge all cleaned up. Got all the goop off. Got the new seal on. The seal itself actually went on pretty well. And it doesn't seem to seal up right around here, um, which isn't a big deal, because I'm just gonna get some additional small weather stripping and put it around here, but probably not until I refinish this top. But it uh, closes a lot better, nice and solid. The only problem is the passenger side because it looks like they sent me two driver side seals. So that's extremely irritating. I have an email into the seller from eBay, hoping they can correct it pretty soon. Uh, I guess I'll have to send that other one back, but I guess that's the way life goes. Anyway, so I got that done. Got the third brake light all done as I showed you before. And I did end up painting this D-ring the color that I think is going to be the uh, contrasting color on this Jeep. I'm only going to put it in a couple few, you know, couple spaces, um, like the diff covers. I don't know if you can see there. I don't know if it's light enough really. I just sprayed a little bit on there. I think it's going to be just enough. I think it'll look pretty good. Um, like I said, everybody does red on black, but I wanted to do something a little bit different. 
and blue is one of my favorite colors so hopefully that'll that'll look okay but if I do it and I don't like it I'll just change it paint is cheap but I'm gonna do the diff covers like I mentioned before after I change the fluid because I'm gonna take them off clean them sand them prep them and uh, it'll be a lot easier that way So I guess for right now, that's probably going to be it for this evening. Didn't do a whole lot today. I think I did just enough. But for right now, thanks for watching, and we'll catch you on the flip side.